Welcome up everybody and welcome back to uh, the channel and I just want to talk about love and just how I feel because I don't talk about my feelings and at the end of the day I don't care about my feelings because the person I love doesn't love me so Instead of, like, trying to be bitter, trying to be like, well, 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 forget you then, I just get so sad and lonely, and it bothers me that I am so sad and lonely. So, if this is the kind of video you don't want to listen to, I understand, and I'll make my normal um, type of videos later, or on this week, I guess. I just wa want to talk about the one, the one that I foolishly let go. The one that got away. The one I should have held on to. That one person in the whole world that means a lot to me. There's a lot of people in this world, but there's only one person out of everyone I have met so far in my life. Who has the most impact on my life. And I don't even know if she knows how much of an impact she had on my life. I mean, how does anyone know what kind of impact a human being has on another human being anyways? I don't, I don't understand love. Sure, I may feel it in my heart and even in my mind that I love somebody. But I come from the point of view if someone doesn't reciprocate your feelings, that you're just wasting your time being obsessed with somebody. And I know, it, there's no doubt in my mind that she doesn't love me. And I know someone in the comments might think, well, you're having a self-fulfilled prophecy or you don't know what she really is saying. But the thing is, I, I think I do know. Even though she never flat out say, oh, no, I don't like you that way, or, or screw off, or piss off creep, or whatever. I know I don't deserve a response. I don't deserve any, I guess, even any indication I should have accepted the fact that that I never said or done anything that proved that I at all cared about her. I didn't I did not prove that I even miss her even though I feel like I miss her. And. It's one thing to feel something. But it's another if you could actually prove. What you're saying. And. All this time. I 
kind of hid my feelings. I just denied them. Tried to suppress my feelings for her. <laughs> but ever since I met her a long time ago, back in my high school days, I just couldn't get my mind off of her. But the thing is, I know I'm a terrible person who's done a lot of wrong in my life. And personally, I just think I'm going to go to hell when I die. And when, when someone like me falls in love with someone with a good heart I feel bad I feel like garbage even more than I already do because I love her because I miss you because you're everything to me and I shouldn't feel this I shouldn't feel this way. I feel like love should be it's something both people agree to and love is something for only good people and it's wrong for someone as horrible as me to love someone so so 10 out of 10. I shouldn't love or miss anyone because I'm a horrible guy. I'm the worst imaginable guy. And if I told you guys why I'm a horrible person, all of you, I know all of you would agree. No matter how many times I try to forgive myself or even attempt to, I just can't. How can I forgive myself for anything I've ever done? I kind of wish she would have just told me no or piss off creep to my face. Because at least then I would know I never had a chance with her. I just hate having that slim possibility of a chance to be with someone who doesn't even love me. And I'm, I'm not making this video out of pity. I'm just making it so I could vent my worthless feelings. I, mean, I know at the end of the day, it doesn't even matter that I love her. If she couldn't love me, then clearly I wasn't meant to be with her. Clearly, I didn't deserve her. Clearly, I'm not good for her. It's just that simple, in my opinion. It's sad that I even want somebody knowing that I'm a horrible person. I shouldn't be in love. And, you know, it's hard to even watch a movie sometimes or any of those cheesy romance films because I truly do think about her when 
when those movies either come on or maybe for a YouTube video potentially or just to watch it for the sake of watching it, I end up thinking about her. I mean, I shouldn't be in love. I shouldn't care. I shouldn't constantly thinking about a person who will never care. I know she doesn't care. And I know she is with somebody, which is even worse. Because cause it, it makes me look like a weirdo and a creep. Just to even want her when I know she's in a committed relationship. Probably since around on the later years of high school or something. I don't even know how long they've been dating. But it's none of my business whether or if if she's dating someone else for like a year or, or three years. It doesn't matter. I shouldn't care about someone who has no reason to love me. And I'm not saying, oh, there's something wrong with her if she doesn't love me. No. There's something wrong with me. Me. As in, in blank cartridge. I'm in the wrong I shouldn't, I should never start feeling something that I know can never ever be reciprocated. I mean, I don't know, maybe you could say I'm desperate and I'm just wasting my time. Or, or I'm just crazy. But I legit it feel tears in my eyes when I think about how much I want to be with her. I cry, and I don't, I don't like crying, not because all all men can't cry or. Oh, men should never cry. No, I don't believe in that bullshit. I believe I shouldn't, I should never cry over someone I don't deserve at the end of the day. I remember back in high school, I just started breaking down crying in front of one of my friends just because. I wasn't with this person who probably doesn't even remember me from high school. I don't get myself at all. I don't get my feelings. I don't understand them. I just wish I didn't and feel this way sometimes. But at the same time, I, I wish I could have a, another opportunity to express my feelings and just get re rejected. Because I, I think her body language told me Hey, I'm not interested, but I'm I'm that dumb. I need someone to spell that out for me.
look like I just broke something in my room. In my recording room, if you will. I'm not expecting to get a lot of views on this, or I'm not expecting anyone to care about my feelings. I'm just venting my feelings to the internet void and whatever. I'm not, again, I'm, this is just going to be like a once in a blue moon type of thing. If I ever feel like I miss her, and I do miss her a lot, but I can't, ex I can't just expect her to just stop by and just have feelings for me, or just say, "Oh, I love you." I always had. I know that's not how things work. Anyways, thank you guys for listening. If you have, see you soon. Bye.